Derek he's actually taking us in his first gen uh, I think it's a first generation Toyota Tundra those things have been kind of like a cult classic now a lot of people are uh, wanting to pick them up I think his has the V8 and everything like that super clean he got it from his dad so they're the original owners and everything and uh, he actually runs um, Prescott bicycle rentals uh, and we are going to he's gonna take me on this trail and we were gonna take the Revel, but I kinda wanna see what those first gen Tundras are capable of, especially when they don't have any kind of lift or anything. So I asked him if we could go in that. And then, uh, and that way I can scout out the road too. So next time we can take the Revel. Uh, I plan on getting some work done to the Revel. So I wanna do it prior to getting everything done. And then again, after to see if it changes anything. So really stoked about it and uh, he should be here in a minute, so let's do this. Yeah, buddy. beast bro <laughs> pretty much all stock too and just killing it made it down to where we were headed what do you call this Derek cowboy corner, cowboy corner look at that I gotta admit man the Tundra's a beast the V8 what year is this Derek 2002 V8, 
What's this? Is this like a Buick? Mopar. Mopar. <laughs> That's sweet. And then uh, 163,000. Just a set of Goodyear Wranglers, 265, 75, 16s. No lift kit on it or nothing. That's brand new right there. We did that. <laughs> it happens. So this is my buddy, Derek. He is the owner of uh, Prescott Bike Rentals. And you can see that we got a nice um, display of bikes on here right now. What's up here right now? A couple Konas. Yeah, these are just a couple of my hardtails. They tend to go out a lot. I've got a lot of full suspension bikes too, but hardtails went out yesterday, so they were still on the truck. So figured they'd be fun to bring along. Yeah, and it and it was like a kind of a discovery thing. Uh oh, look at that, Happy's Trails. What? <laughs> so it was kind of a discovery thing too to find out what it's capable of with the bike rack and surprisingly it did really good there was no uh no spots where it even got close actually yeah i was worried about this clearance right here and naturally we're on kind of a dip but uh this bike being the longest it has run into the ground before and it had total plenty of clearance in it but one thing you did to prepare was air up the airbags you have on this too right yeah and that yeah, kind of lifted up 40 PSI. So lifted up the back a little bit. So it did really good. I mean, if you guys can get a first generator, generation Tundra, they it just proved it was a beast to me. I knew they were, but yeah, I love it. It was comfortable too. So let's get down to the water and check it out. One thing that we didn't, I don't know if you could notice is it does have a little exhaust on it. Derek's gonna start it up for you real quick. and. What exhaust is that? What exhaust is it? Just a Magnaflow. Just a Magnaflow. <laughs> Love the way those sound, man. And the V8 sounds good with it. Yeah, you don't Yeah, this is sweet little beach. Yeah. Like, it's, this is an insane spot, huh? Yeah. Super nice. It's deep. This is awesome, dude. Okay, now tell me the why it's called Cowboy Corner. Is that what you call so, it? Yeah, so the reason this place is called Cowboy Corner is um, my friend Shannon, who told me about this spot, that I'm not going to share where it's at because that's kind of the deal. But Shannon, who's a guy, he was down here and uh, it was when this area was sunny and he was laying here in the sand, just totally naked. And after a little bit, he looks up, up on that ridge up there and uh, he sees these four cowboys on horses <laughs> sitting up there just looking at them. And uh, they stayed a little while too long, but because of those cowboys being up there, that's why this place is called Cowboy Corner. Cowboy Corner. Yep. That's awesome, man. It's beautiful. You can well, just spend all day here swimming. Yeah, I appreciate you bringing me here, man, and I'll keep it a secret myself, you know? So, we're just going to get to some relaxing, maybe some tasty beverages. So, thanks for following. Hit subscribe and uh, share it if you think somebody might like the video. Click on that bell if you want to be alerted. When a new video comes out. Thanks for following Happy Trails. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, buddy. <laughs>